Hey guys, this month on Gender Perspectives, Tom and I are going to be doing something a little bit different. Instead of us answering a couple questions, we're going to answer one big question with a bunch of different answers. We are going to be giving you a bunch of different signs on how to tell if a guy likes you. This is one of my most requested topics, so much so that Tom and I decided that we're also going to do a video over on his channel. So if you want to hear the signs, then stick with this channel and afterwards go and hear some stories so you can implement some real life situations over on his channel. So that's linked down below and here we go. There's there's obviously a ton of different signs and it totally differs depending on the person but something that I look for is if I'm sitting in this group situation and you know everyone's talking if the person that I'm trying to figure out if they like me tries to involve me in the conversation that's a big sign for me because it means that they want you to be a part of the group they want to include you they want you to feel good about being included in the situation you know so if they go out of their way to make you feel included to include you in the conversation to get your opinion I think that's a pretty good sign. Just in general, if he gravitates towards you, like if he can pick to sit anywhere in class or at lunch or anywhere, and he sits near you, odds are there's a very good reason for it. Or if you're walking down a hallway, he passes you, he says, hey, again, there's probably a reason why he's like, I mean, yeah, obviously maybe he just has to go that way, but like if he's trying to get your attention in little ways like that just to pass you, there's a good chance he's into you actually. Also, if he like shows up outside your bedroom window, good chance. He probably likes you a little too much. But that's the kind of stuff you gotta look for. Like, just ask yourself, if I liked someone, would I be doing this? Even just look for signs that they like you as a friend, because if they like you as a friend, at least you know there's like, there's hope that it can become something more. So all those little signs definitely add up over time. Now this is such a fifth grade thing, but if someone teases you, obviously teasing doesn't mean like, I literally hate you and want you to die. It means like, oh, you're such a nerd, or like, oh yeah, good one. Like being sarcastic and being playful in a way that you know that they're joking, you know? Not like, I actually want you to go and not be around me anymore, like please get the fuck out of my face. You can tell the difference. It's really not something that you need me to differ for you. Just looking at your social media. Like if they follow you on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, they follow you home, odds are they like you. But if they retweet you and favorite you a lot, that's a, that's a good sign. Like that's a really good trick. If they post something on Instagram, just post a selfie of yourself and just see if they like it. Because if they do like it, um, that's how you can tell they like your face. Especially if they don't like any of the other pictures where your face is not in the photo. That's like a double sign. A big one for me is if someone laughs at my joke. And here's the thing, I'm funny like 50% of the time, and then 50% of the time I say really stupid shit that I think is funny, but no one else does. And if they laugh at that latter 50% of stuff, I know that I'm in. Because if someone's gonna laugh at stuff that is not in any way funny to normal people, then we may just have amazing senses of humor together, the two of us, or the more likely option is that they're just trying to make me feel good about myself and they like me a little bit. So if they laugh at your jokes, if they like compliment you, oh you're so funny, oh pretty, oh you just with the hair looking good today, that's always a good sign. One of the biggest ones ever uh, is eye contact. Like I don't care who you are, I have a rule. If a girl stares into my eyes for more than like five seconds, it's on. Like that's a thing, like I don't feel comfortable staring into someone's eyes unless like I'm really comfortable with them, I trust them, uh, or, or just, just like basically all good things. Just make some eye contact. There's also like some psychological thing where it's like apparently if their eyes, like their pupils dilate more, that means like they're really really into you. Or they want to like kill you, like apparently that's what it means, like if their eyes dilate, they either really like you or they really hate you. So if you're having a good conversation with them, they probably don't want to kill you. So it's probably a good thing. But the last two kind of go together. Eye contact and just being overall flirty. Like you know usually if someone's flirting with you, if they're being like stereotypically flirty where they're being a little bit touchy, they're looking you in the eyes, you know, they're you know staying some sort of close to you, they're laughing, giggling, like ah. Oh. Like all the things kind of put together. Are they your big sign? Do you feel that chemistry? Are they being nice to you? Are they leaning in? Is their body language towards you? And open. You know, it's just, you can't take one sign as like, oh, he looked at me, he totally likes me. It's a mixture of all of these things, and if you have all these things, then you can take it a step further and just kind of put it out there like, oh, you know, there's this movie I really want to see, or oh, I would love to go get some coffee right now, or oh, I'm so bored, what are you doing this weekend? I'm not doing anything, like, ask me out. Or you can obviously take the reins and be like, hey, did you want to go grab some coffee? You want to go see a movie? Like, once you think that they like you, now's the time to do the next step. So 
we hope that that video helped you guys and make sure that you check out Tom's video with me in it. It is the top link in the description as is all of Tom's links. He's got his YouTube, his Twitter, his Tumblr, so go check it out. Thumbs up if you enjoyed and make sure that you leave other things that you look for to see if a guy or a girl likes you in the comments down below. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you later. Bye!